Welcome back to another video, you guys. Today I am going to show you all of the cleaning products that I found at Dollar Tree this weekend. So let's get started. Okay, a little update on my life. It looks like we are moving and we are moving pretty soon. How exciting. I can't wait to share this new chapter of my life with you guys. So I decided to start getting ready to clean the new house. So what that entails is me doing a deep clean of that whole house before we start moving stuff in. But what do you need for a deep cleaning? You need cleaning products. So I went on a little rampage of like cleaning products at Dollar Tree. Some of them are from the dollar section, but some of them are from the plus section. So we're going to go over all of those today. I'm going to show you everything that I got. And most of these items I have never tried. Some of them I have, some of them I haven't. So I do want to do like an updated review on all of these products and see what I would repurchase again and what I wouldn't. But they are brands that I've heard of and I think I'm going to like them because I've purchased some of these brands before and I like them. But yes, okay, enough talking. Let's get started with the first product. I also got a lot of cleaning products from Amazon. I will do that video after this one because I got a lot of stuff on Amazon and I don't know, I'm just so excited to open everything up. Okay, first product that I got are these stain removing, no, stain remover wipes. Now these are from the dollar section. It says it removes excess stain before use. It says it lifts stains from all fabrics and they're great on the go. Honestly, I don't know if these are going to work. I've never seen these. I've never tried them before. Let us know down in the comments if you have and what you use these for. So I'm excited to put these to use, but don't really know what I'm going to do with them. I got some Scrub Buddies sponges. These are the heavy duty scrub sponges in the two pack. They have different types of sponges at Dollar Tree. I like the ones that actually look like sponges. I usually get mine from Sam's, but I was like, you know what? Let me try these Scrub Buddy ones and see if I like them. This is a tried and tested product from Dollar Tree. This Lysol Cling Gel is one of my absolute favorites. And I love that it comes in a little bottle because you can dispose the bottle once you're done using it. And I don't know. It's great. I love it. I did buy a big size of the Zep brand because I wanted to try that one and kind of compare both of them. So that'll be in the next video. But yes, love this one. I love the blue one, but I also love the purple one. I got two of these. I also got some soap from the dollar section, the Palmo... Palmolive Oxy Deep Grease Cutting Power Dish Soap. And they also had the Dawn Platinum. I actually buy the big bottle of Dawn Platinum and I love it. It is my favorite soap ever and I don't think I'll ever replace it. I usually get the Ajax ones or this brand for like the shower um, and this one for dishes. I just love it and I got it because look at this cute little bottle and if you I use a bottle like I don't have an actual like soap dispenser like beautiful bottle I want one but I don't so I like getting these and just refilling the little bottles I've bought gloves from Dollar Tree before but these are vinyl gloves it's a 10 pack so five pairs um I like to use gloves when I'm washing dishes or I'm cleaning the bathroom just because my hands get really sensitive. So we're going to try these out. I have used the ones that come in a one pair. I love those. So I don't see why I'm not going to love these. Off topic, they started bringing out like Coke edition products, but this was the only thing that I saw that they had of Coke, but I had to pick it up. It's a pack of two maybe 32 ounce cups I don't know I love them I love coke products in general so anything coke related I have to have it here's the other clean gel that I was telling you guys about okay I bought this 50 pair of snack bags I don't know how good these are for snacks 
compared to Ziploc, they're probably a lot cheaper quality. But I actually got these so I could add vinegar and put them to clean like the faucets. I've never tried it, but I heard it works. So you just fill them up with vinegar and then you cover like the shower head with it or like the kitchen faucet with it, stuff like that. So we're going to try that out in our next video and see if it really does work because people say that it works. So I believe them. I also love picking up little towels at Dollar Tree. I got this a bar mop towel. I actually got two of these. These are like a rougher material, but I feel like these are going to be really good at like drying your hands or like picking product up if you like drop like a liquid or something. So I really like these. I've picked up these multi-purpose cleaning cloths. This is a pack of two cloth cleaning cloths and I love using these. They do get dirty quick and they're kind of hard to wash because they kind of like separate but I love cleaning with these. And this was the only black like kitchen towel kitchen decor item that they had in black so I just went ahead and picked it up. This is just a microfiber feeling cleaning towel. I love these. I have the blue ones right now. I'm obsessed with them so I just decided to get them in black. I also picked up this masking tape at Dollar Tree. I had mentioned to you guys before when you want to label something but you don't want to like write on the box or write on the back just write on the tape and stick it on and when you need to i don't know remove it you just remove the tape and you're done you didn't leave like a marker on your bag or on your box you just left it on the tape love it oh apparently they had two of those kitchen towels so i picked up two and then okay so dollar tree has a section where it has like the the broom head the mop head the duster head and then you buy the stick well they didn't have any sticks this time around but they did have the broom head and i like using this one to clean my tile on our shower it's like a standing shower so I used to like get down on the floor and like scrub it and oh my gosh that would hurt my back so much I was like there has to be a better way so now I just replaced these Dollar Tree um, broom heads and it's fairly inexpensive and they do a great job okay before we move on to the last products these are like some random products that I found that I had to pick up this is a self watering planter you basically remove the bottom add some water on here I think you want to add like some like a shoelace type thing like a little string so you put the string through the hole so it touches the water and then now that string carries water anytime your plant needs it and now you have a self-watering pot. I loved this. It's so cute. They had different colors. I picked up this beautiful like brown color. Love it. I also picked up these pink glitter cutlery sets. It comes in a 24 pack. It has spoons, forks, and butter knives. I just thought this was so cute for like a little girl dinner or like a girl. Like if you're hanging out with your girls, you're having them come over maybe for some charcuterie or I don't know, some snacks. This is going to go perfect um, for like your little girl dinner date. I don't know. I loved it. It makes me feel happy. They're pink. They're glittery. Glittery. They're fun. I love them so much. I had to pick them up. I also picked up this six piece of citronella sticks um, for outdoor use. You just like stick these in some in a pot with rocks and or you like stick them on the ground and they're supposed to keep the mosquitoes away. I will use these and let you guys know. I'm pretty sure we're going to have like a carne asada when we first move in. So we're going to put these to good use. I showed you guys these salt and pepper shakers. These are a hit in our house, but somehow they always go missing. I don't know how. So I bought some more so I can have extra... I think I'm going to hide one where only I know where it's at. So when I'm looking for the salt shaker, I know that it hasn't been misplaced. But yes, 
love the Dollar Tree salt and pepper shakers. I absolutely love these. These are probably like one of my favorite new products at Dollar Tree. And then we're going to start getting into the plus section items, starting with this basket. This is a very lightweight laundry basket. This was in the plus section. This was $5. We have a rolling laundry basket but i actually want we're actually gonna have a walk-in closet now so i want to put this in the walk-in closet so when this gets full that clothes will then move on into the laundry room and it won't like sit there in our laundry like in our closet do you guys have any other tips of how to keep your dirty clothes in your room or in your closet let me know this is all new to me we usually keep <laughs> currently we usually keep ours outside of our room <laughs> uh there's like a little hallway that separates my our room my mom's room and the bathroom and that's where we keep our laundry but i don't know what do you guys do or do you think i should buy a hamper with a lid on it because that's what i was thinking i should do but okay let's get on with the next products these are gonna be I think there's still some from the dollar section, but there's going to be a few that are going to be coming from the plus section. So give me a second. Let me put everything back in here. And let me show you those products right now. It looks like I have five more products to show you that are still from the dollar section. So let's start with the first one, which is distilled white vinegar. I'm going to use this to clean. Dollar Tree also has a cleaning vinegar that's like where all the cleaning products are. Honestly, I don't know the difference. I should figure out what the difference is. Like, can I clean with distilled white vinegar or not? I don't know. I'll figure it out. Let you guys know if I figure that question out. We also got this a pine glow. I'm guessing this is a dupe for pine saw. I love the way pine saw smells, so I figured I'd give this a try. This says this is an antibacterial and disinfectant for kitchen and bathroom. I have like a brown glass bottle spray, spray bottle that I usually refill with whatever disinfectant I have. So it's running low, so I'm figuring I'm going to use it for this. Okay, it kind of smells like pine saw, but not as strong. And it smells more piney than like that lemony like cleaning smell that pine saw has. Okay, we're going to give this a go and we're going to see how we like it. It is a big old bottle for $1.25. That's crazy. We also picked up this Chloralin bleach. It says it's a deodorizer, whitens, and deep cleans. I've never used this before. I usually just get Clorox bleach. I don't know what the difference is. They also have a bigger bottle of bleach at Dollar Tree. I don't know if it works as well. But I have, I added some to that glass bottle that I said I had another one. I added some of this with some water and it's been working great with like cleaning my kitchen when I'm doing dishes so 10 out of 10 already for that haven't used it for anything else yet and we also have this Comet classic kitchen cleaner with bleach again haven't used it yet can't wait to use it I will let you guys know how this works and this next item kind of surprised me I cannot wait to open this up these are Tough Plus non-abrasive all-purpose cleaning wipes. It says tough on oil, grease, paint, glue, food stains, food stains, and soap scum. And they're for your auto, home, or office. 160 wipes for $1.25. I couldn't believe it. So if these are as amazing as the packaging entails, then these are going to be one of my favorites. These are not disinfectant wipes though, they're all purpose cleaning wipes. I am learning about cleaning barely and I'm 30 years old. It's kind of embarrassing. I am very new to the deep cleaning world. So I am learning as I go and hoping that you guys will learn with me if you don't know. And if you know more than most of us, then you should teach us. 
your tips and tricks. Yeah. Okay, anyways, I'm just kidding, you guys. Let's start with other Dollar Tree Plus items. And the first one we have here is a favorite. It is the Dawn Platinum Dish Soap. This was $5. It feels kind of expensive, but the Platinum Soap is usually more expensive than the regular Dawn Soap, and I think that it does make a difference, plus it smells better. Love it. And this one is in the Wild Jasmine scent. I didn't even know they had different scents. But okay, I love this, love this. $5, and it's like the squeeze, so you don't have to be like opening and closing. You just squeeze it out. 10 out of 10 already, I love it. Okay, it is gonna be my first time moving into a house with a dishwasher. I've never used a dishwasher. I didn't know that I needed one in my life, but everybody that has a dishwasher says it's the best thing ever and that I should use it. So, I bought some Cascade Platinum Plus dishwasher detergent is what these are called these were either three or five dollars i don't remember they're probably five dollars and i've heard a lot of great things about these so i'm gonna start with these to use the dishwasher and let you guys know how they are working for me um if you know of any other brand that you think is better than this one let me know down in the comments and i will try it and compare both of them because i am just so brand new to this and then we have these zep items actually we have two of them that i found at dollar tree and some that i found on amazon i recently found this brand and i'm not gonna lie I kind of really like it so I recently bought a bunch of the other like Zep cleaning products and I'm gonna test them out to see if I like the brand in general or just like specific products but this one in particular is the foaming shower tub and tile cleaner it is an acidic no scrub formula it removes soap scum calcium and dirt um, erases tough grime and hard water stains so if we move into this house, this there's going to be a glass door or it's like a glass shower door or whatever. So, I'm really curious to see how my my new cleaning life is going to be. So, can't wait to try this on our bathroom. And last but not least, I also bought this Zep cleaner for five dollars it is an all-purpose lavender cleaner concentrate it says it cleans and deodorizes in one easy step and it's safe on floors kitchens bathrooms counters so you can use this to mop you can use this to clean your counters you can use this to clean your bathroom whatever this has you covered so i know i bought a bunch of different things and I can probably narrow it down to only using a little bit of items instead of buying all of this but like I said I'm new to this like cleaning life and I just want to test everything out and see what I like and what I'm gonna keep using but if you have any tips tricks answers questions leave them down in the comments and yeah we'll go from there but that was my Dollar Tree haul. I paid around $63, so I thought it wasn't bad because of everything that I got. Usually, if you buy stuff like on Amazon or Walmart, you end up spending a lot more for cleaning products. So, $63, I thought that wasn't that bad. But, oh, and one more item. We also got this two-tier... <laughs> Mm, storage rack for five dollars i want to put this one in the garage so when we come home with like dirty shoes we can leave our dirty shoes in the door and we don't have to bring them inside so we're gonna build this in the next video and see how it looks in the garage but as of right now we have an, we have gone to underwriting and we are just waiting i think to get approved the house was appraised a week ago it they told us it was gonna take a few days to get the results back 
so right now we are just waiting we do not have a closing date yet um and when we do i will give you guys another update but as of now we are just trying to live days the same i haven't really started packing anything because our house is so small the moment that i start packing things it's gonna look super crowded and we don't really know when our like move-in date is gonna be because we will have to fix some stuff in the house so i'm holding off on that so yeah you will continue to see some videos in this house still but i'm super excited this process has been so exhilarating so new so crazy but it's been such a wonderful experience. Um, if you guys want to know anything about that, you can let me know. But yeah, I guess I'll close off the video here. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. We are at a thousand subscribers. It is crazy to say that. Thank you to all of you for your support, for watching my videos, for commenting. I love you guys so much. And I will see you on the next one. Bye.